Hello everyone and welcome back to Gwim Creates an Age of Sigma Army. That is correct. Since last what episode went over like a house on fire. It really didn't. It got like bugger all views but nah fuck it. I'm doing this because I enjoy it. So even if only me watches it then that is worth it. Hello previous me. Hello. Anyway. So last time I started off with a Daughters of Cain battle force my Age of Sigma army. And this month, I'm working on some Doomfire Warlocks, as you can see. I was going to do a box of Witch Elves, but I got distracted because I quite like these models. So, there we are. Now, I must admit, it was an interesting challenge because I've actually, with lockdown and everything, it's very hard to find paints. And I've run out of black, um, Chaos Black or Abaddon Black, whatever you want to call it. I only had um, a bit of a spray left, so I spray undercoated them, but then I couldn't actually make any mistakes because I didn't have any black to touch them up. But I did a good job overall. Um, Xeros purple on the on the horses. Of course, I've used Thunderhawk blue and um, Incubi darkness again, trying to link in the thing of the you know, visual theme of the force. And of course, the white here, it's actually a bone, white on top of bone. Now, that red spot is where I fucked up and accidentally put some red on it. And because I didn't have any black, I need to cover it up, so I've made it look like a blood spot. But aside from that, I must admit the horse actually looks pretty good. Of course, washed everything down with agrax and uh, based every one of them with some gravel and a bit of sand, and of course some tufts. I'm a bit of a sucker for tufts. But yeah, overall, been pretty successful month. I was doing about one rider or one horse every um, two days, which is pretty good for work out for me. I like to do one model a day sort of thing. But no, overall the force turned out pretty good. So I'm quite happy. Next month I'm definitely going to knuckle down and do some witch elves. Not sure if to do them witch elves or sisters of slaughter. Both, mo both model kits look good. Witch elves are more traditional. I am going to have both in my army eventually, but yeah, I just need to decide what one to do first. So cheerio for sticking through this if you did, and I'll catch you again another time.